Many people around the world are benefiting from the IAEA's technical cooperation program. In the Caribbean region, nuclear techniques are helping to address problems in food and agriculture, water and environment, health and nutrition, industrial applications, energy planning and radiation safety. Access to clean and sufficient water has become a challenge in Jamaica, where scientists are using isotopic techniques to protect the island's water resources essential for human health and agriculture. By analyzing water molecules, experts can determine their source, age, and quality and locate fresh water even deep underground. This information will assist us in evaluating and allocating the water resources to understand the recharge or the source of this water, quantify the polluted water. With such knowledge, countries can manage their water resources in a more sustainable way. In March 2015, the Mediterranean fruit fly was detected on the east coast of the Dominican Republic. The fly threatened fruit and vegetable crops and affected their exports to other countries. A nuclear technique, known as the sterile insect technique, helped local scientists to control the problem. This method is a type of insect birth control. It uses radiation to sterilize male flies, which then mate with wild female flies, but produce no offspring, thereby reducing the number of insects. Republica Dominicana no tenía ningún mecanismo para detectar ni esta mosca ni ninguna otra. Era necesario la liberación de machos estériles para erradicarla como ya hoy prácticamente lo tenemos en el país. In Belize, zoonotic diseases such as rabies and avian influenza were found in cattle and poultry living close to humans, restricting the local supply of meat and eggs and impacting international trade. Nuclear-derived techniques can help detect virus in 24 hours. Early diagnosis can help isolate and treat infected animals quickly, preventing major outbreaks. It's very important for us to quickly detect these diseases and, and take action so that you don't have the spread and it doesn't impact the, the industry in a negative way. Harmful algal blooms have been increasing in the Caribbean Sea. These tiny organisms release toxins and damage sea life, making people sick and destroy livelihoods. In Cuba, scientists are using a nuclear technique to measure these toxins in seawater and fish. Es posible conocer, por ejemplo, cuáles son las especies más tóxicas, cuáles son las áreas más propensas a encontrar eh, a peces tóxicos. This knowledge helps improve livelihoods and combat the effects of climate change. Radiotherapy, nuclear medicine and X-ray diagnosis are essential tools in the management of illnesses, including non-communicable diseases such as cancer. With the help of the IAEA, the first public service in nuclear medicine will be established at the University of the West Indies in Jamaica. The Technical Cooperation Program helps Caribbean countries in the safe, peaceful and secure use of nuclear science and technology.